pediatric distal forearm fractures are more common than you might think, yet they often lead to unexpected complications. Redisplacement, where the fracture shifts after initial treatment, occurs in 10% to 20% of cases. Understanding why these redisplacements happen is crucial. It allows for better treatment strategies, ensuring young patients heal properly without further complications. Enter the CAST Index, CI, a revolutionary tool in pediatric orthopedics. It measures the ratio of sagittal to coronal width at the fracture site, ensuring the cast fits snugly. A CI of 0.8 is considered optimal. This precise measurement helps reduce the risk of redisplacement by ensuring the cast molds perfectly to the forearm's natural shape. In a comprehensive study of 1,001 pediatric cases, researchers sought to determine the optimal CI. Redisplacement was defined as more than 15 degrees of angulation, or over 80% translational displacement. The results were telling. A significant difference in redisplacement rates was observed based on the CI, highlighting its importance in fracture management. Patients with a CI of 0.8 or less had a redisplacement rate of just 5.58%. In contrast, those with a CI greater than 0.81 experienced a staggering 26% redisplacement rate. This study confirms that maintaining a CI of 0.8 is crucial for minimizing redisplacement, making it the gold standard in pediatric forearm fracture treatment. Higher CI values correlate with increased angulation and displacement. For every 0 point, one increase above 0 0.8 comma angulation rises by 3.09 degrees, emphasizing the CI's predictive power. The CI is not just a number, it's a reliable predictor of redisplacement risk, guiding clinicians in crafting the perfect cast. To achieve the ideal CI, ensure the cast is oval shaped, not circular. This shape maintains a proper fit, reducing the risk of redisplacement. Utilize three-point molding techniques and avoid excessive padding. As swelling subsides, a well-molded cast prevents looseness and maintains fracture stability. While the CI is crucial, factors like obesity and excessive padding also play roles in redisplacement. A holistic approach ensures better outcomes. Proper technique and diligent follow-up are essential. The CI is a key factor, but not the sole determinant of fracture stability. By achieving a CI of 0.8 comma, you significantly reduce the risk of redisplacement. This simple measure can transform patient outcomes in pediatric orthopedics. Implement the CI technique in your practice. Stay informed and continue learning to enhance your orthopedic skills and improve patient care. Remember, the CI is a powerful tool, but it's part of a broader strategy. Combine it with other best practices for the best results. By focusing on the CI and other factors, you ensure optimal healing for young patients, reducing the need for further interventions. Let's work together to make pediatric forearm fracture treatment more effective. Your commitment to learning and applying these techniques makes a difference. Join us in revolutionizing pediatric orthopedics. Implement the CI in your practice today and witness the positive impact on patient outcomes.